and welcome to this Regenesis video in which we'll be talking about Regenox PetroCleanse. We're here in this warehouse which is contaminated with petroleum hydrocarbons in the groundwater. A pump and treat system is being used to remove this contamination and we're going to use PetroCleanse to enhance the abstraction of the contamination. PetroCleanse is an evolution of our in-situ chemical oxidation product, Regenox. By applying PetroCleanse to the subsurface, we cause the temporary desorption of soil-bound contamination into the groundwater. The pump and treat system can then remove this contamination, making it much more efficient and cost-effective. This allows us to hit targets more rapidly and avoid rebound due to desorption once the system is switched off. Let's go and see how PetroCleanse is mixed up and applied on site. Here we are at the mixing area where Matt is going to go through some of the equipment required to make up PetroCleanse on site. Firstly though Matt, if you could just say a few words about the personal protective equipment that you're wearing. Sure. So when working with PetroCleanse, you should wear PPE in accordance with your site specific cost assessment. Typically, this will consist of splash-proof coveralls, nitrile gloves, a dust mask, and either full-face visor or goggles. Okay, great. Maybe you could show us around some of the equipment we've got here as well. Okay. So here we have our mixing tank with a mixing paddle in its base, powered by a hydraulic power pack. The mixing tank feeds our diaphragm pump, which in turn flows through a simple manifold assembly. We can use this to either recirculate back into the tank to aid mixing or to divert directly to the treatment area. Now we'll take a closer look at the mixing process. Regenox PetroCleanse is a two-part system. The part A oxidant is a powder which is either supplied in 25 kilo sacks or for small applications in tubs. The PetroCleanse catalyst is a liquid which is supplied in tubs. Apply the required amount of water into the tank. While agitating, add the Regenox Part A into the water. A typical mix would require 6% Regenox Part A to water. Continue to agitate until fully dissolved. To apply the PetroCleanse Catalyst, first open the cap using a bung opener or an adjustable grip, the product is then ready to pour into the mix. Pour in the PetroCleanse, agitate for a few minutes and then the product is ready to apply. Now that the PetroCleanse is mixed and ready to be applied, it can be injected into the subsurface. It can be injected using direct push whereby a rig drives a rod such as this into the ground and injects it. Often on PetroCleanse sites, you're using the abstraction wells that we're here to enhance. By lowering in the stinger and packer assembly, you can inject into the subsurface in these wells. Once the PetroCleanse is in place, it will cause a temporary desorption event one to two weeks after application, which can then be pumped out of the ground. As we've seen, Regenox PetroCleanse is very straightforward to mix and apply on site. It can be used with any abstraction system in order to improve its effectiveness and save money and time in the remediation of your site. 